Hey guys, welcome to Skip YouTube channel. Today I want to have a exciting uh, news about the Skip test. Today I decided to explain or introduce about the Skip test. What does it mean or what is that Skip test? Okay guys, today I want to tell you how to find the issue or troubleshooting on the public voltage by multimeter. Just to first explain about the public voltage. Public voltage, we know this is the battery connector, one side positive, one side negative. This is uh, negative is grand or earth, and voltage from positive comes to the smart. Just uh, and I want to tell you, uh, you can use the skip test on the smartphones if you want to use the uh, skip test on the old phones or normal phones you need to check after power management unit or uh, power ic this is the charge ic and comes to the pmu or power management unit or power ic and we know on the public voltage this, this here between the battery connector and charge IC, we said B battery. And this side uh, on the Samsung, we said B bat or VPH underline PWR. And on the iPhone, we said VCC VDD. And this two side is connected, for example, to PA or to the speaker ampli and uh, light that's the public voltage that's a uh, chip in need a public voltage to turning on that's for uh, for example if his battery is 3.8 this voltage is comes to the this chip and what is this chip is doesn't work. We know that the CPU have a 1.8 volts voltage to turn on the this chip or IC. When it press the power button, the CPU start to processing when the turn on the chips or IC. Uh, this 1.8 volt is very important. And after that, I explain about this. But just I want to tell you how to find the issue in there. This is a public voltage. Because when it's connect uh, this power supply to battery connector or uh, connect the battery to here, that's real, this voltage comes in there. That's a, like you can say the standby voltage. Come in there and wait to you when you press the press the when you press the power button. The CPU will start to processing and turning the boot and uh, software and main team. Just only I want to tell you how to fix the phone, how to find the how to how how troubleshooting by multimeter in there. It is a public voltage. V battery between the battery connector to before power management IC. This about the public voltage. Now, this here is have uh, two iPhone 8 motherboards. Just the first I want to show you by DC power supply. When it's connected, what happening in the, the first is check the this motherboard. This, this is a normal motherboard. We know when you connect the DC power supply cable to the motherboard, uh, need be doesn't showing any current in there. That's a voltage is fixed between the before I told you between the 4 to 4.2 volts and that's it doesn't change it and this now is on the 4.1 that's okay and you see this current is showing the zero that's mean is the normal need we press the power button and check the motherboard but now it doesn't have any problem or issue in there this normal we want to check the abnormal motherboard, this one. You see? Voltage gone, current jumping. That means have a large 
leaking current or short circuit on the public voltage. That's easy. Okay, that's we understood by DC power supply. But now I want to tell you we set the DC power supply only by multimeter. Uh, I show you diode value and skippy test. And I want and tell uh, I first I want to tell you diode value showing the current value and skippy test showing the voltage value. This is completely different. Now the first uh, normal phone. Turn on the multimeter and bring on the diode value. I put the black cable, you know, it's a positive on the earth or ground and black is negative, it's connected to the component IC ways or positive way. Let's connect the black cable to a uh, battery connector positive pin for check the diode value. This S smartphone can be start from here, battery connector. It show me the 442. This is the diode value. Now skip it this. Only swap the cable. That's here and connect it in there. This voltage value showing the 1295. That's okay. This is the normal phone. Now comes to the uh, this one. This is have a, a large current. Now we test in here. Show me the diode value of 435, like this, normal. But now we check the multimeter. Then use the skippy test. This is showing the voltage value. 540. This one showing the 1292. That's it. That's fun. We set the this power supply, you know, this one had a uh, large or short circuit. This this issue, this have a, this issue. Okay, we look into the formula. Easy. For example, you check the one form. Uh, diode value showing the three hundred. Just wait. I want it completely. I tell you about the, this. Okay, this is the easy formula. If when you check the diode value and skip it test, skip it test need be showing the triple then diode value. That means 300 multiplied uh, 3 equals 900. That means uh, we can say 90% uh, you don't have an issue on the public voltage. That's the normal. It doesn't. I don't say it is hundred percent. That's that side is okay. That's way is okay. Just only said is it doesn't showing any problem. But when you again you check the motherboard, this time it's showing the two point five. That's mean three hundred multiplied two point five and equals seven hundred fifty. That's what I want to tell you about this. If it's this uh, equals, it's very close to 900, for example, 850, may it doesn't have an issue or have a very low thinking about the, this way. Or very close to 750, may is have an issue. But if it's showing less than two points, look like the 700, 650, 500 that's mean you have a issue in the like low uh, leaking, small leaking current or large current or short uh, circuit if it's said is hard to fix the this issue that's mean when you have it this you find that this number that's mean uh, you can use the voltage injection on the public voltage to find the issue. But 
is the voltage injection or le uh, leaking before on the public voltage is have a two type direct and indirect and have a two type is different to find the issue usually many technicians use the normal voltage injection and find the direct issue but indirect is have a different way please watch my video subscribe my channel to bring the a lot easy solution to find the problems that's it this is about the skippy test and uh, uh, diet value that's it thank you for watching i'm awaiting your suggestion and uh, see you next video